One more. Ready? Sound. 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 Ooh. Before we began our letters journey, when we were looking at our data, we realized that 31% of our students were on grade level, were able to read. After just a year and a half, our latest data point shows that 51% of our kindergarten through second graders are proficient readers. Letters has allowed me to have the knowledge to break it down into simple parts that my children can, can understand. Pieces. I've been teaching a long time and I had never in my life taught the sound part, the phoneme, I mean just taught listening for the phonemes. I had never had any, any type of curriculum that emphasized that at all. And you learn in letters that as a high predictor of the ability to read. I feel like just in the past, you know, you have your students that are able to catch on quickly. They're just, you know, the easier, they get it easier. It just comes quicker to them. But then you have your other students that you're just, you know, you're trying to figure out how do I help them? And you try, you're trying everything. But Letters has showed me what they need to know, the foundation for what they need to know, and how do we take them from here up. If we can't read, then we are going to be limited in our opportunities. And so it is important that we understand as educators that learning the science behind reading and how to learn to read is opening doors of opportunities for these children that they may never have. I remember many nights um, he was in tears reading. Um, he was frustrated. I was frustrated um, as an educator. I didn't even know how to help him um, before I received the letters training um, and before we were introduced to that curriculum that, that marries so perfectly to the training we received. I had a better understanding of how his brain was working and what was um, hindering him from being able to um, be a successful reader. Blend that together, put it together. Truly! Good job, you did it! You know, they say knowledge is power. This professional development through letters is powerful. And so if you have the opportunity, everyone needs to do this because it's, it will be it will reap benefits for our students across the state. It's just, it's that powerful.